Your discretion is advised. So, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of Air Gun World? This is your boy Will here again. And today, we are out here, me and my good friend Mike are out here at the golf course and we are golfing for iguanas. For iguanas? <laughs> what are you talking about for iguanas? We golf for iguanas? There you go. That's what we're going to be doing. Well, this is what we're doing, guys. We are hunting here at a private golf course. I uh, don't want to exclude any names, but we got permission from the owner, uh, which is a very wonderful person. Uh, Mike did all the uh, leg work as far as getting the permission for us. So we have a permission here in South Florida uh, that me and Mike are actually attending to be a hopefully a regular to this uh, local golf owner of this beautiful golf course here in South Florida. Uh, Mike, so what are you thinking here, buddy? How's, uh, how are we looking on? Uh... We got some great weather. Sunny, clear, the rain stopped, clouds are going away, but a little bit of a heavy breeze. Heavy breeze, yeah, I, I kind of said the same thing too. Uh, the weather, you know, supposedly is not really good for the iguanas to be out during this temperature. But it's good for us. It's good for us, yes. <laughs> we're not sweating, we're not hot, we're loving it right now. Yes, sir. Um, so we, we spotted one iguana. I, I, you know, I want Mike to take the shot on this one, uh, even though he doesn't have a scope cam. Uh, but you know what guys, I'm going to show you what the aftermath is going to look like. I'm going to try to capture it on video while I'm recording it. He's taking a shot. So Mike, please have the honors while I uh, videotape you. Okay, I believe, how many yards you say that? Uh, 30, it looked like 32. 32 yards. Okay, so we got a 32 yard shot. Now we do have people there, so we may have to wait, Mike, yep. until they're cleared out. Uh, but it looks like as soon as they clear out, we're going to have a good chance of getting this, uh, that one iguana. 32 yards. Okay. Let's see if we can spot this guy. Okay, Mike's taking a shot. Hopefully we we'll get on video, guys. Ready as we're gonna be. Good shot. What was that? You shot him with? Point something green. I don't remember. Okay. With the impact. With the impact. All right. Let's go take a look. it guys a monster perfect placement right behind the ear the eye between the eye and the ear I nice. see that's what it looks like right there right yes perfect headshot Perfect headshot, guys. This one here looks very vicious. Spines. I'm telling you, the other one really, ones. really hard. Spiky. Awesome, man. Awesome. Congratulations, buddy. You did it. All right, that's one for the bucket.
I got one hiding. But I don't know if I can get him. I don't see a, a head. But it's going to be a body shot most likely. Oh, I see I see his head, but it's I got bush. I got the bush right in front of me. There we go. That'll be a hell of a shot right there. 20 mile per hour wind. 50 yards. Small little target. Let's see. Little window. Got him. Got him through the bushes. I got him. Woo! That was a vicious shot. That was vicious because I had to wait for the bush to move out my way. Wow, what a shot. What a shot. That was amazing. 45, 50 yards. I think he's trying to swim but he's not gonna make it Okay guys, well, uh, I apologize about the audio there. I did not have my channels in the right sequence. So therefore, I'm doing a voiceover. But uh, real simple, uh, just ending the video. This was day one. Uh, me and Mike went out there, we had a blast. Uh, the only thing that uh, you know was a challenge for us was the wind. It was gale force winds like up to 15 to 25 miles per hour at the time we were there uh, throughout that whole day but you know we didn't let that affect us we had an awesome time a great time actually and uh, we're excited to go back again uh, these are just some of the iguanas that are in front of us uh, the ones that we were able to hold in this one little area we had 18 holes to look over so they were scattered throughout the whole golf course but this is the location we decided to film and so this is what you see 
but uh, Mike was very, very, very happy. I was extremely happy, and we had a very successful hunt, uh, or pesting, if you want to say, because we did not hunt these guys. We were just eliminating them, so it was a pesting. But um, just want to give you guys uh, a big thank you for watching. I uh, want to give Mike a big thanks for uh, getting us this location uh, to uh, get the permission on. And um, we're excited to go back again, man, whenever we can. So uh, hopefully it'll be in the near future. But uh, this is uh, part one of this video. So remember, stay tuned because there will be a part two to this video. Uh, we got a total of 60, no, I apologize, 56, 56 iguanas on day one. And uh, most of them were in the lake, but we had a couple of, of them on land and we were very happy to know that we came out here uh, in February and we got a lot of them. So thanks for watching guys. I really appreciate you all. Uh, subscribe if you haven't and uh, give us a thumbs up here and uh, leave us a comment on the bottom and uh, hopefully we will see you on part two of this video stay tuned god bless america